Hi. Wait, who's hosting it? Who like hosting the. Arrived, yes. that, there she is. Hello, guys. Hello. How are you all doing? Wait, I have to do something real quick. Just quick. It's okay. We're going to wait a little uh, for everyone to join. Uh, oh, thank you, Andy. No problem. <laughs> Always do that. Hey, everybody. Hi. Hi. Happy, do you want to start the event? Wait. Oh, sure. Wait, Ravi, are you in a riot? Start. Are you an Orion? Yeah, I'm an Orion girly. Ah, Is that... <laughs> I'm an Orion too. But almost all of us kind of, you know, we are I'm very like, popular. Yeah. Like 60 or like 80% Orion, so like, uh, oh, I'm great. Oh, same. There, one second. Hello? Hi. I am mostly Orion too. And a little bit of serious here and there. Okay. Welcome, everyone. Thank you. I hope you are all you. so excited to learn. <laughs> we are. See how on point, yes. uh, on time we are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, <laughs> even more than me. Some of you. <laughs> there was police control everywhere. Oh, you know, it's oh, the same here, too. Yeah. I don't know why. Hmm. Same in my country. I don't know why police are doing these days. Mm. Welcome, everyone. Well, I'm glad you were able to join. I, am too. I hope I, for I won't forget speaking English. <laughs> you if you do. Well, you know, it's my first class. I'm very excited. Yay! Yeah, yeah, yeah. And sometimes when I'm speaking too much, I accidentally say something like in my own language in the middle of the sentence without noticing. <laughs> if something like that happens, please don't care. <laughs> Don't mind me speaking another language in the middle. <laughs> okay. Hmm. When should we start? Do you, do you guys want me to? What's up, everybody? Start right now. Hello. Oh, hi, Ski. Another remote moving king has arrived. <laughs> <laughs> Is remote viewing like another way of saying astral projection, or is it like its own thing? Well, but there are different ways to do remote viewing. I'm going to talk about it in the class, and one of them is astral projection. Oh my god, we are so crowded! <laughs> Let's Welcome, go. Everybody. <laughs> everybody wants to learn remote viewing today. <laughs> Yes. I, when I first learned about remote moving, I was so excited. I was like training a lot. And it actually helps with other stuff too. Okay. Let me check. Hey, Ravi. Hey, babe. <laughs> hey, everyone. Hello. Okay, so... Ooh, nice. Everybody, please open the screen I'm sharing. Ravi, <laughs> <laughs> the doll, gray queen. <laughs> yes, it's the me. Control remote moving, practically explained. And this class is especially for the ones who haven't, you know, got into the 5D yet, you know, 
If you haven't really opened your psychic abilities yet, this is going to be the deal. So. Let's get started. What is CRE? So CRE is basically short for Control Remote Wing. And it is an interview and report methodology that you do by communicating with your subconscious and consciousness through your physical body. With improving remote wink, you can see anywhere within the space and time. Don't forget, even if there are places you think is unreachable, everything everywhere and everyone is connected to each other. So, <laughs> we're going to get the information no matter how. <laughs> never give up. Okay. Damn right. <laughs> okay. Let's see. There are three ways to get the information. The first one, send your astral body to the place you wanna visit, you know, you wanna see. Second, see with your third eye or your astral eye. Just you know, send your eye. And the third one is getting the information through the collective consciousness, because we are all one with the universe. We are all the same. <laughs> we are all connected. So, uh, you can use all these three ways, depending on the mission, or, you know, do your own way. Mix it, all, mix it up a little bit. And this is me <laughs> doing remote doing. Am I so <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pro tip, you can also clock yourself before doing remote moving for extra protection. And also we're going to do like a little meditation and clock work, like shield work, just before we start. So, get ready. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna head out. So, uh, when we're doing remote moving and you know getting this uh, informations about something else, you know, when you see like a vision, or you maybe you're getting uh, signs as a smell or hear a sound, get chills, you know, stuff like that. When you're getting messages and informations from another dimensional stuff, these informations always come to us through our subconscious mind because our subconscious mind actually speaks the you know real language they know the real deal they know the stuff but they're not telling us so we're going to tap into it so <laughs> the consciousness and subconsciousness speak different languages that's why when you get a message like uh, your guide might be like literally screaming at your ear like do something <laughs> but you hear it as a like a ringing sound in your ear like I'm sure all of us experienced this at least once. So when this, when we get this message, our subconscious mind actually like knows the language. They know what the message was. But our physical body is like, well, what was that? I don't know. <laughs> I don't get it. So we're going to literally like communicate, talk with our. Uh, thank you, Andy. By the way, <laughs> I'm kind of excited, but I'm also very high in the energy and happy about this. Anyway, so we have multiple bodies, so the body knows all the languages. Okay, I'm going to talk about uh, the lemon a little bit. So lemon, uh, can I swear? <laughs> yes, I'm you can. Like, I'm just <laughs> um, oh, I, I was gonna say lemon is a bee. <laughs> the CIA used that to okay. on the lemon is a bee, guys. Lemon is not nice. <laughs> So lemon is basically like a sh uh, like a wall, like hey, the matrix. The matrix is wall. Okay. Uh, lemon is the line between the awareness and uh, unawareness. Imagine it like a sheet that blocks the information and messages your subconscious already know, but your conscious mind is not aware of it yet. So uh, you see, this is us. This is the matrix uh, line, the lemon. So. And if everything under it is your unawareness, the things you're not <clears throat> aware of yet, your subconscious mind and the subliminal. This is where the word subliminal comes, by the way. And everything on top is your awareness, your conscious mind and the superliminal. So uh, when there is this, you know, blockage, the limit, and uh, you cannot move the information around it, you can move the information through your body like this boop, boop, boop. <laughs> and as you uh rise like uh, get your awareness higher and you move to the 5d and uh, stuff the limit gets thinner and thinner and finally disappears so you don't have to do all this hard work anymore but right now 
there's the lemon so we're going to move around a snake a little so we're going to use that beautiful body of yours yeah wait one thing i'm gonna say is um <laughs> so, yeah. emoji, but, but one thing i'm gonna say <laughs> about remote viewing is it's not just yeah. like seeing and viewing it's also can be remote hearing remote feeling. yep you can use all your clear senses like you yes you we're going speak. to use all of the fire senses I will teach it with an example. So, Day two. so Sam, <laughs> yeah. What you say, Ski? Stay tuned on Str Stravos. Okay. We're gonna be like, if you're yes, gonna get yes. good, it's gonna get even better than this. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna now. We're, now I'm just giving some little information. We haven't even started I mean, to do the start. remote doing. <laughs> My name is a bit complicated. <laughs> It's okay, right. we're going to win this war no matter how. I like how you so, put four slay. We, we haven't come that part. Okay, don't read. I'm reading. <laughs> I'm okay, there's, there's going to be some little rules and practices I'm going to give. But you don't have to really. Because, you know, you can write your own way. But this is um, the first one. Anyway. <laughs> so, the Wildern Remote Wing. I just recommend keeping your eyes open i mean some people feel like they want to they need to go ahead do it but if you train with your eyes open you know while doing remote viewing you can literally remote view while you're looking at someone's eyes straight and you're you know imagine like someone is talking to you and you feel like they are lying and you're like looking at them haha <laughs> yes i listen and while you're speaking you do remote moving like you don't even have to close your eyes you check you know if that guy was lying, you can check, like, move to the place, see it. Because you can see the past and the future stuff. Then you'll be like, you're lying. I just saw. <laughs> I mean, it will work better for the future if you train while, you know, keeping your eyes off. Anyway, so. Uh, at first, uh, describe the target. Do not identify. It's very important at first, like, because when you're getting these uh, images and the smells and all this information through your subconscious mind, at first, the like, you might get, like, an exact vision of something, but it doesn't mean it's the exact same place, you know, maybe your mind was trying to show you something else, so at first, it's better th to just describe it, and uh, later on, you can identify after you got all this you know, uh, informations. And, by the way, if you don't have your uh, paper and pen with you right now, like, get a notebook, because we're going to practice with a notebook, like, write with writing, so... Write everything down! Even though if you're not sure of it, that might mean something else later, you will understand, so just write everything. And while you're writing, like, if, uh, when we start writing, <laughs> Always uh, put your pen to the paper. Always, you know, feel the pen touching the paper, even though if you're not ready to write anything yet. Because it will make the things faster, the connection. Okay, practice makes perfection. These uh, practices, I recommend doing it after the class, like uh, maybe tomorrow you can do it. Uh, it will train uh, your vibe check senses you know the vibe check is very important guys to do remote <laughs> so the, what, uh, the first thing you can practice by observing your surroundings whenever you change a room whenever you change a place you go somewhere you can just you know just observe the place a little you know try to focus on the small details that you usually do not care for just to open you know your senses better second throughout the day note how your body is reacting to different places rooms people and circumstances so, your body's reaction is actually the way to communicate through your subconscious mind. So, that training with this, like your reactions to the places, uh, will help you very dearly. Third one is, this is just basically, you know, like a practice thing you should do no matter what, if you want to be a remote weaver or not. Writing your dreams and journaling, you know, it just will make a, a better communication with your subconscious and conscious mind. And the fourth is always the slay, guys. We have to slay. 
You have to. We are going to slay. This is not even <laughs> a recommendation. We slay, guys. <laughs> okay. So let's get on to it. Epic. Thing. Okay. Like I said, control remote doing is actually the spiritual way of doing the vibe check. You're doing a vibe check when you you know go to the place to uh, see. <laughs> So, like everything in life, this is going to take some time, patience. So, we're going to practice. Practicing makes perfection. <laughs> so, uh, to, to, to become a pro at the remote doing, we're going to meditate, affirm, and practice to become, you know, the best that we can be. Okay, so we're going to do like a little meditation and affirmation to set, like, put our intentions together. If you guys, <laughs> let me... okay, so we're going to take a deep breath together. Let's do it. Take a deep breath, hold it a little, then exhale. And you can repeat after me, the, uh, or you can just um, listen and say, like, I accept this message. I'm going to read the affirmations. Okay. I am a spiritual being. I am able to perceive anywhere of time and space. My consciousness is ever present with all that is, all that ever was, and with all that ever will be. It is my nature to perceive and know all there is to know everywhere at all times. I seek to learn and evolve to further my spiritual growth and become a master remote viewer. Okay. We accept this affirmation. And now we put out our intention. Now we're ready. Okay. Before we actually start the remote view, we're going to do a little cloaking and shielding up because basically you're going to do astral travel. <laughs> okay. So right now you relax. Imagine a light and a power coming from your heart and surrounding you, slowly growing. This energy shield is unbreakable. It will always protect you. Then imagine another power and light coming through your heart. It surrounds everywhere in your physical body. And imagine it all around your all of the bodies. It's around your astral body. You can move your hands and arms and you will see this energy surrounds everywhere within you and it moves as you move your hand <clears throat> and say, I am invisible. Congratulations. <laughs> Okay, so now you're all shielded up and you are all cloaked. <laughs> so we are safe to do remote viewing. Now, I want you to choose the way you want to do remote viewing. Like I told you, there are three ways. You can basically do astral travel, like literally send your astral body to the place as you are just awake on Earth right now. Or you can try to open your third eye and just, you know, send your eye to the place. Or you can try to get the information from the collective consciousness. Whatever you do, just choose the way. And yes, you are in... <laughs> get ready. And if you are not sure what to do, you can always ask a guide for help. So, you can... Just, you know, openly, t openly talk to your guide right now. Just say, you know, help me. <laughs> help me. I want to do a remote view. And you can ask them to, you know, choose the way you want to do it too. It's up to you. Okay, so we're going to do remote viewing through an uh, example. So... I'm going to give you guys a code and this is going to be uh, a place on earth basically just you know we're not leaving the planet yet we're just on earth 
and I bind the code with a photo. And I'm going to give you the number now. This is the number. I want you to write the number on top of a paper, you know, on your notebook, whatever. Just write the number. I'm going to also write in the chat so nobody miss it. We're going to do it together. So, okay, spoiler. This is the place like the uh, it's outside. It's not inside of a building. So, I'm going to give a little spoiler at the beginning. Then no spoilers. <laughs> okay. The phase 1. First, we're going to get a graphic info from this place. So, uh, we're going to start writing. I want you guys to write these symbols on the paper. Uh, these symbols are just, you know, basic popular ones. If you want to use another symbol, like, oh, I don't want to use this symbol for water. I'm just going to do a little swirly. You know, go ahead. And if you... Uh, Ali, you can do a screen, but I kind of want you to, you know, touch the paper. <laughs> well, you can do a screen if you want, if you don't have a paper. I'm also drinking tea right now. <laughs> oh, it's okay. You can use your phone. Okay, so <laughs> so we are using the ideograms. This is the gestalt, gestalt sense. So you draw the land, just you know, you draw the line. This is this symbolize the land on this image. So you can put your finger to the symbol you just draw and slowly brush it and just feel the land just focus on the land how does the land feel like is it hard do you feel like is it like solid hard or just do you feel a soft place you know just write little words do not try to you know um, describe and identify just write little words how does the land feel like then move to the water and put your finger to the symbol and when I say water, it resembles like every wet thing, basically. <laughs> like what kind of water feeling, like a wet feeling you're getting. It might be something like, I, I don't know, maybe you see big thing, like a big water. Maybe, you know, maybe you just saw literally like a image of an ocean. Do not just write, you know, ocean. Just write the big water. <laughs> yes, right. <laughs> yes. <laughs> We're just now starting simple, so... Maybe you saw, like, uh, a wet feeling from the sky, you know, maybe you just, maybe you didn't feel anything wet, just dry, just, you know, right, if you felt like that, just right, no. <laughs> so, man-made is, resembles basically everything humans uh, has touched on. <laughs> it might be buildings or machines, shapes, you know, cars, ships, vehicles, stuff like that. So if you feel something ma man-made is there, a human, you know, touch this place. <laughs> Whatever you're getting, let's write a little note. Am I moving too fast, by the way, guys? Do you guys need more time? I can slow down. Oh, you're good. I'm good. Okay. Yeah, you're yeah. good, man. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, natural is basically anything exists in nature. It might be grass, sand or trees bushes flowers maybe you, you know anything like earthy okay ali no. and bio and living no. means living you might be you might get humans animals just you know if you don't feel there is just you know you can write no or if you felt like a human was there, you can write there or not. Or if it feels like crowded 
or feel. We can also, you know, write no notes like that. And the air is basically the air. And maybe you can feel the weather or, you know, feel a wind. Or do you just, you know, feel an em like an air em empty field, like an emptiness of air there? And motion is basically, is there something moving? Like maybe you felt birds flying, maybe you felt water hitting, like the waves. Maybe you felt something moving, like uh, maybe you saw a vehicle passing, if something like that. Or you may just, you know, feel like a breathing. <laughs> basically, like a movement. So, this is the phase one, so you don't have to get too specific. When you guys are done, I'm gonna go to the phase two. You can also put your finger to the code, the number I just gave you to feel the place a little. Okay, so I'm going to move to do phase two and three. Now, you are there. So, whatever you, if you sent your asu body or your asu eye, you are there. <laughs> now we are going to start writing all the words and the vibes. And just like I said, write everything down if you're not sure. You know, it doesn't hurt. Just write lots of stuff, whatever you got. All the, you know, images, visions. And when I say do not identify, describe, I mean like, you know, when you, if you saw, for example, a wheel, you can write like a circle, man-made, metal, you know, um, the shapes. If maybe you saw it like move so you can turning motion you can write that up this is just an example so it does not mean <laughs> but i don't give more more spoilers <laughs> okay i already know what it is i feel like now now we are using the five senses so so we were using actually we are using six senses the first one is the vibe check <laughs> the sense of ambience what it was so now we're going to go with the five senses so the first one is vision i want you to write if this place feels bright or dark and is it colorful and if it is how like what colors are you seeing write the colors and second hearing do you hear anything? Maybe there is like a, you know, natural sound. Maybe you heard like an animal or the wind on the trees. Or maybe you hear like a machine, like a vehicle sound. Or maybe you hear like human speaking. What, you know, the voices, what kind of voices? Okay, smell. Now take a deep breath. You're basically there. <laughs> you're interact. Like, imagine you are interacting with this place, and if you like, mm, you can walk around this place, and you smell it. What smells are you getting? So about the taste, you know, humans are very. Uh, diff different creatures, <laughs> very interesting creatures. If you didn't taste something, you already know, you know, how it did, how it is, you know, taste like. We all have that information for some reason, and I don't know. <laughs> Maybe you can use that. Anyway, so the touch. So imagine like you're 
in this place walking around, you're touching maybe the uh, the floor. <laughs> you're touching the things <laughs> around. Like, do you feel something hard or soft? Or maybe you felt something pointy. What? What was that? <laughs> uh, you want me to give more spoilers? We are not done yet. <laughs> Wait, no, I don't. No, I don't want to give. I don't want you to give any spoilers. But I kind of no don't know what it is. I'm not saying anything. Well, I mean, maybe you already know, but we don't know if you're right. We will see together. Lady. You can DM me right, right now. Lady. Come on. You can DM me right now. What do you think is the place? No, I'm not gonna. I can, can, I, I, can I DM you? All right, yeah, gonna... you can DM me. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it must. It's my lady. Come on. Where are you? Okay, now the next step I'm going to talk about while you are DMing. <laughs> the shapes and. Uh, with this information, you can now do a little sketch of the place. I'm I'm not talking about, you know, draw the whole place. <laughs> but maybe you felt some shapes there, some plants there, something there, some living things there. So you can just, you know, uh, do a little sketch to get a better idea of the place. So, now we are... Almost done, guys. <laughs> You're doing amazing. I don't know, but I'm sure. <laughs> okay. Now, I, if you are all ready, I want you to write a little description of the place. Like, try to name the targets, but you don't have to be, like, specific. And... So, you don't, at the, you know, and you don't have to write everything. Like, maybe you had some ideas, but then you were like, man, I don't think that was it. So, you don't have to add everything at the end. Just write your idea at the end to, you know. Did you message me? Yeah. It's not right. <laughs> I'm sorry. <No. laughs> it's not right. Nah. Nah, I think I was like rushing it too much, probably. I mean, this is like a. I think I, I mean... got a little overconfident <laughs> in rushing it too much. This is not very important, Alia, by the way. You don't have to do every like uh, step so with uh, so much detail. No, I'm you so can, sorry. You know, you're okay. <laughs> no, it's okay. Today. Maybe your the idea was <laughs> not my slay day okay. today. <laughs> okay. Lastly, try to give the time and place details at the end. So you're basically done. Write your best guess. Uh, I mean. Uh, Ali, you can DM me something if you want, but if you have a question, uh, we're, I'm going to give a time specifically, you know, to for the questions. Two. But you can DM me if you have a, you know, private uh, question or something. Okay, I'll DM you. <laughs> <laughs> so, did you guys... Uh, write your, you know, last, last idea. Your I probably should have wrote it down, but like I didn't. So maybe like next time I will. Drum rolls. Okay, I'm going Drum to rolls. open the <laughs> the answer. But uh, we're going to do other ones. 
So this is your first time. If it is not perfect, it's all right. Are you guys ready? I'm going yes. to open the photo. Yes. <laughs> Very ready. <laughs> Drum rolls playing in the background. Drum roll. Bye -bye. Wow. I this get... was the photo. Okay. I did get the. Okay, I did oh, get the. I, I got something the... very similar. I did yeah, get. Yeah. Really? Okay. I let me felt tell you. it was Europe, and I kept seeing. Yes, like, it is Europe. Yeah. yeah. I got it really wrong. This but is the... Oh my god! Yeah. Did yeah. get right. That was Italy. Like, the dry feeling of it. I don't know, like the dry taste and like. So, I'm going to talk about this place a little, so maybe you guys might saw other stuff. Wait, are you Italian? So, this is... Sorry? Are you Italian? Is that what you picked? Oh, no, I'm Turkish. Ah. I'm in Istanbul right now. But anyway, I just... I like Italy. <laughs> so, this is a castle in Italy, Europe. And it is the sunset time, and it's the May. So, if you got, like, a weather... Feelings, warmness, stuff. So, if you write anything like, you know, hard land, there's the water sea, there's a water vehicle, there are the buildings, human made, obviously, there are stone, there are people there, there are birds there, the colors, like the green and blue, and there are like warm colors there, orange and stuff, there are flowers, what about the you know, plants, you said, trees, yeah. and it is light, sunny, and there what are motion of people walking. What about like the numbers you said, like four, five, six, two, one, eight? Yeah. What, what about them? Like you said something like that. I, I just gave a code to this image. Uh, wait, so so that... you can, you know, connect the place with the code I am giving. Ah, I get it. I so, thought it was like it was literally okay. like a postcode or something like that. No, it will spoil. <laughs> that that was a, just a remote viewing code so you did amazing guys I give all of you 100 points <laughs> so about this place if you did an astral travel and if you actually you know was in this place you might get another images or uh, you know vibes from because maybe you looked at the place from another point of view so I put another photo of the place so if you saw like lots of colorful stuff, lots of, you know, buildings and stuff, there was a lot of it in the background, actually. So about the either grounds, there is hard ground, there are stone, dirt. Also, there are sand because there's sea there. There's a sea, there's a, like, a, if you wrote like a pool, lake, we got all of them. <laughs> there are buildings, stone, wood and glass. There are also like plastic stuff. The, there are uh, vehicles. So, about the nature, we got trees, bushes, and we also got moss and seaweed around. So, about the living beings, there was definitely lots of humans, birds, and there are like jellyfish and the fishes in the sea too. Maybe you got them. Okay, air was there was open sky, there was wind because the flag was. Uh, shaking <laughs> and there is like clean air maybe you got a sea smell or something and there was a motion of walking people you know breathing driving and sailing stuff like that so i hope you guys uh feel like you got somewhere at least <laughs> with our uh. first try I mean, I got the sandy, hard ground, stony, dirt sand part of it, right? But, um, the rest, not so close. <laughs> I'm just looking at the messages right now. You guys did amazing! Play. <laughs> sandy. Yeah, and the nice. So you said that this, uh, the picture was taken in May? Yep. Okay, so that might have been when I picked up on the... I was picking up on like rain, like humidity, and it rains a lot in May, because it's springtime. 
So that could be it. Yeah, it is very like humidity because of the. There are lots of, you know, water. And it's not mm -hmm. super hot, but it is sunny. Oh, you. I just you know, in the, the second most... one, it kind of looks a little thing, rainy. Yeah. <laughs> nah. The building I drew no of you. Ravi, no spoilers. <laughs> I will give you spoilers. You cannot okay. stop. <laughs> <laughs> the building I drew kind of looked like it too, because it was like a tall building with like a circle. Because they have this those like, open, yeah. open, oh my open God. I just saw your. I just saw your drawing right now. It looks funny though. <laughs> No, this is exactly the stuff I am expecting. Like, you don't have to basically draw everything. I just want a little symbols. So you get the idea, you know. Of where the place. Angie, there is a beach literally here. Do you see it? Oh. There is a beach. Really? <laughs> yes, here. Like, I'm sure. Can you guys see my mouth? Yeah, I see. It. It's so tiny. <laughs> but I keep seeing, like, I mean, the little, like brown sand it and is, all it is either italy so <laughs> there okay, are so many makes, beaches around that makes me feel better because i'm like i kept seeing a beach <laughs> that's why i put the second photo of the place so you you're like you did the astral travel there yeah alan was like damn the beaches <laughs> the beach I we should do. throw a, a party I, in the I just beach, you know? i literally like do you know who i got like literally like ravi already knows but i literally imagine like the number plate four five six two i mean this is just eight, a code i gave like, to the place on a it doesn't really gate and it was like in the desert and tech or something like that, and it was like gates and stuff and there was a small base well. and there was some guy like some old guy, like security guard, like sitting on his chair, crossed legs, having a cigarette and listening to Christmas stuff on the radio. Wow, <laughs> bro, you your asshole buddy has been to some other place. He got distracted. <laughs> yeah, it has. He was into know. some other Maybe stuff. Maybe now the uh, fun, though. now the government will try to spy on me now that I visited that base. It's Aliyah, that's amazing. Girl. Thank you. I'm gonna do this way more. <laughs> okay, uh, anyone got then. questions? Since to ask for a project, I'm literally have to go to sleep then have like a really long meditation or stuff. Yes, kid, that's it! You guys are all psychic. <laughs> well, actually, do you guys know, I got uh, this remote wing information through like a class i took and the class was the, like the people who took it was doing remote wing for amazing stuff and they were not even spiritual they didn't know anything and they were just doing remote wing like that bro <laughs> <laughs> and like some people use it for the earth stuff uh like i heard like there was this guy he's an archaeologist and he was looking for somewhere like some place who was now buried at the sea so he was looking for this place for 17 years and he couldn't find it like then after he took remote wing class he did, did remote wing to the place did astro projection basically and after that they found the place bro oh. <laughs> now i feel sorry for this and guy, this guy is to, like... like literally like a 3d person he's like uh not and not at all spiritual, nothing. He probably never meditated in his life. And he literally found the place through remote viewing. Like, and after that, they literally like went physically to there. And, you know, they actually found the place, saw it. And he mm -hmm. said, like, I am looking for this place for 17 years. No, like, I feel sorry for this guy. He's been looking for it physically 17 years. Only to yeah, find that and remote viewing is a thing. And they could have killed her after minutes. 17 yeah, okay. 17 minutes. He found it. <laughs> no. no hate. Okay. No 
Okay, fork, you saw the trees, nice. Oh, you saw the co like the exact colors of the flowers in the background, you know, the orange and the red. Green and blue, that's, they are all correct, by the way. You wrote like... Um, your handwriting is not very nice, by the way. <laughs> Try to read. But you, you wrote water, that's correct. To wipe. Peaceful, right? But yeah, that's I amazing. Yeah, images when I was doing it, so I was like, eh, I don't know what to do. So I just wrote both of them. Yes, yeah, you I wrote, didn't write them all, the draw them. So, like, next time I'm gonna try writing them all, John. Because, like, nah. I have my okay, third it, name, but, like, I just. If you guys them. don't have any questions, I'm going to move to the next target. Okay. Move on. Okay. Another one. Next paper. <laughs> <laughs> so this one, I'm. I wanted to try. You know, different. It's a place inside of a building. So we are inside, right now. Oh, sorry, you did amazing. Oh, I love how you guys all, you know, write all this stuff. Okay. Now we are doing 893019. I'm also going to write in the chat. And just like before, this is just the code I gave to the place. And it is inside of a building, whatever, what kind of building, we don't know. I mean, I do. Okay, now you got the number down. At first, we are doing ideograms. Then, we are using our senses. You know what to do. So I'm just going to give you guys a little time. Okay, bye Miguel. When you guys ready, you can write in the chat like up down. I'm ready. <clears throat> yes, thank you, Skin. You don't have to overthink, you don't have to, like, push yourself to get the exact same place. Just, you know, relax. Just write literally everything you're getting. Until you're kind of sure of the vibe in the place. <clears throat> <clears throat> and focus on, like, you are literally, like, inside this place. And I give you the spoilers. You know, you are inside. <laughs> Like, imagine how your body is reacting to this place. How this place is making you feel. Then Im focus on the visions, the colors, the sounds, the smells. And if you got like a 
very strong feeling about this place like for example maybe you're sh not sure of the visions you got but you just got this really strong smell of something you know write it like a bigger <laughs> Oh, Angie's already ready. Slay. <laughs> Alan is working. Yeah. I hope he didn't get distracted again. <laughs> oh, I hope not. <laughs> the beach. He was like, oh, girl, the beach. <laughs> <laughs> he loves the beach. <laughs> oh my god. I'm going to throw a beach party just for him. Oh, and he has to come, you know, with the sw yeah. swimming suit. <laughs> <laughs> Shirts not allowed. <laughs> Shirts not allowed. <laughs> Where is Broly? <laughs> oh, they're busy. He's also oh, invited. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna send you like a DM, so this is what I got. Okay, like okay. you don't have to send a DM, by the way. <laughs> I'm going to open it soon. Uh, I mean, if you guys are all ready. I don't want to spoil anything, but this time I actually wrote it down. <laughs> Rather than just be like, oh yeah, okay. fuck yeah, I'm just doing... I actually wrote it down through it. I'll just send you it. Mm. And once you're done... I would just say, wait and hold on to your answer. You, you're about to get the revealing soon. Oh, you guys wrote uh -huh. me. Sorry, I'm going to check the DMs. Some people check. I, I don't see your new message. I just saw your wait, I'm going to see. Wait. You haven't sent it yet. There, I sent it. Wait, Ravi, did you see? Hmm. Hold on. <laughs> oh, you got some stuff. Nice. You well, think I got it right? Well, the end is not correct, but the stuff you got, like the smell and the, you know, your senses. Ah, that's uh, very correct. They're correct. I'm not gonna spoil anything, but I guess I did think not spoil of what I said. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, you guys are ready. I see. I'm ready. Almost all of you ready. So, and it was. Boom! 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 Texas Roadhouse Restaurant! <laughs> oh. I thought it was a museum. <laughs> Bro, you wrote you are getting food smells? And then you write that's a museum. Know, How someone wanted <laughs> eating a sandwich while they were in the museum. I don't know. <laughs> someone was having like a little sandwich. <laughs> I mean... You got the senses right, but I don't know why you thought it was it at the <laughs> I don't end. Know. So they like hid art artifacts and stuff. It was quite far off, to be honest. Uh, it's okay. Inside the building is harder. That's why I, I don't know. I always one. like and the other like, ones are outside. I shouldn't be assuming just because it's like December and it's the holiday season. But I always assume yeah. there's someone with Christmas stuff. And, and the, some of the yeah, the, well, there might be probably you know Christmas stuff happening there right now. Yeah, nah. Yeah, I did sexist. like see some guy with the um Christmas songs on and like Christmas decorations. But did yeah. anyone? Can I see you guys? Oh, wait. Uh, Ali, actually, you got some stuff correct. I see. She got also the food vibes. Nah, um, Andy? Yeah. 
I don't know. <laughs> Rich people home. Don't look. Yeah. Rich to me. I was getting uh, like the exchanges of people or, like uh, items and stuff. I wasn't picking up like on food too much, but I was picking up on like a lot of movement, socializing. Yeah. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah. Yeah. I was this picking photo, that up too. This photo oh, yeah. it got uh, from that a review. And it was from a black lady and she also put like photos of, you know, her family eating there together. And there was like little two kids. It was very crowded. No, like I always think there was definitely be people walking that's right. Some crazy ass museum, all these artifacts, but so it's actually there's some stuff right here. <laughs> I don't know, maybe they're underground, like there might be actually like below might be like above like some secret ancient civilization of like a Gotha Atlantis Lemuria. <laughs> you got that. <laughs> and you're maybe just, like you know, it's just right above like I mean little, you really Restaurant. You really want some, you know, bases um, and stuff, but I am just trying to, you know, show you guys, like, and then below it, simple might places be, like, on Earth. Secret artifacts of Atlantis, Lemuria, Gartha. I mean, or, like, I literally... Civilization. <laughs> Bro, how can I put a real photo of Atlantis here? <laughs> I'm just using simple know. photos of Earth. <laughs> I don't know, it might be, like, some secret stuff on the ground. <laughs> I mean, the building is kind of big, not super... Like tall, seeing all the people that like yeehaw, my little takes and lunch, and they have That's like the crazy probably not true. artifacts <laughs> under it. What's going on here? By the way, guys, the amazing. Um, so if you guys felt hot in there while you are doing your moving there, this is why. <laughs> yeah. If you didn't know. <laughs> well, it makes sense. Sorry. That's what. That's why it's so dry over there. That makes sense. Uh huh. That's the driest state in the USA. How much that means, guys? See you later. Maybe being close to the sun might affect the yeah, yeah. That's so-called this, this, this is the, the yeah. This is the right place action. I just sent you guys. Sorry. Mm -hmm. So yeah. another one. Oh hi, Luca. Hi, Luca. Ah. Okay. Hello, hello. Is it? Hello, hello. How much did I miss, Professor? Uh, That's what I would like to know. You missed all the information. Crap. I was traveling. Relax. I was, I was quietly uh, okay. trying not to admit that. <laughs> Wait, you have like... Can like, so I can improve my remote viewing. Can anyone like tell me any tips on the heavy method or send me techniques? Meditation. Yeah, <laughs> okay. No, sorry That's to number one. Driving. Be yep. more connected to your higher self. The, the moment yes. I did that, I gained yeah. actual of, awareness. So instead mm -hmm. of like um, doing a guided meditation, I thought to ask my spirit guide to higher self to do the guided meditation for me, you know? If you trust your intuition enough, perhaps. Yeah. I mean, basically, raising your awareness, like, uh, you know, I show you the limit as you go higher in the vibration. As you move through the you know, 5D, the limit will all get thinner and thinner and finally will disappear by itself. So you won't even need to have to do all these ideograms and, if, you know, using your five senses stuff. I will just give you a code and you will say, you know, you are, you will literally see through your asshole body. So you won't really? have to try to get like all these reactions like, and stuff. To be fair, like I had to do writing, but I really like remote viewing. I think it's cool. Okay. Like, I have a question. What? Yep. Like, okay, because I was out, uh, this is just for a uh, background context, like uh, working at Target, they put me in the clothing section. I've never been in there before. And it's very hard to locate items. And so like people are ordering items online. And so I would see the item out of my frustration. I was like, you know what? Let me see what I can do with my little psychic abilities. I don't know if this counts as remote viewing, but what I did was I would look at the picture and then I would just have it in my mind and then I would let my subconscious just take my body to where it knows or feels it is. And then 85% of the time it was there. Yeah, that that kind of sounds like something similar. People use their like dreams for remote viewing like I heard. Mm -hmm. Which makes sense. Oh, thank you, it's not. You do leave your body and stuff. Look, I am so happy you have arrived mm. because we're going to 
uh, do a remote link to a special place at the end. I see. Oh. Okay, so now we are practicing with the place. Yeah, this is. Uh, we're now remote link to the you know place on Earth, basically. And I give you a little spoiler. It's outside again. <laughs> it's not inside of a building. So. No, I know you're gonna yeah, be like switching from one to another. So let's focus on the next one because I wanna move kind of faster. So write the code. Write your ideograms. I'm just realizing the synchronicity as well. Yep. And you know what to do. Then you're going to use your six senses. And the first one is the wipe check. Never forget wipe check. Oh, nice Momo. Oh my god, you literally have the same birthday as me. 826. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh. I've, never, I've never seen these kind of synchronicities. It's crazy. That is crazy. Oh my god. Well, this is somewhere... So maybe you guys will uh, connect with this place. With this image I put. Wait, don't put it yet. I only just Yeah, started. not yet. Give me like one more minute. No, of course, we are waiting. Spoiler, it's outside. For real. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you all want a little spoiler, maybe I can. I mean, the people who don't want spoilers, just write right now. Okay, it's okay, and you can give a little break. Spoilers. I also have you don't want. A okay, I'll I DM you a spoiler. Okay, I will check it out. If you sent it to me, I think. <laughs> well, I'm seeing the same images over and over, so I maybe got my answer. You guys ready? No, yeah. no, no, no. Wait. <laughs> okay. I'm <really> sorry. <laughs> I'll give it 10 seconds. It reminds me of like when I used to play Sonic the Hedgehog and it would like play like the dark. Andy, maybe you can give a little, you know, break. Take some air and you can come back. I mean, I got a little more. Hold on, let me check how many more I got. Wait, I'm going to send it to you now. Okay, I'm done. Okay, I got four more. I mean, I got this one, then two other one, then the last one is my surprise. 
maybe we can skip uh, some of them. Andy, you got to use your ADHD as a superpower. Yeah. Exactly. Take your ADHD Are you ready for out on the remote viewing. <laughs> Yeah, doesn't that speed up your processing power and then you end up multi multi Let your mind wander in the area that we're remote. We're remote, 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 remote you. They sent you send it to me. me. Yeah. Let's see if it's right in any way. Let's see. Maybe my autism might have helped in this one. Maybe you got my, some uh, rights. Like definitely right. some rights. Just DM me what I got right. Now, I'm going to open it right now anyway, if you guys are already. Yes. I'm ready. <laughs> okay. I don't know why, but I'm it was opening like... the target. It was low vibration. No. Yo, I wow. kept seeing oh. a palm tree. Costa Rica! <laughs> Bro. Oh, wow. I kept seeing a beach and I oh. kept seeing palm and some <laughs> something told me don't look at the ocean, turn around. And Hold I'm saying, up. I was oh, nice. No, there's the volcano, yeah, there's the plants. Oh, man. I was. I know. No. I got some good at the plants and got that okay. rainforest. I didn't see the. I saw <laughs> an abandoned I the volcano, monkey. Though. I saw an abandoned <laughs> church in the night, really humid, in the middle of the forest. Like, nah. It was all oh, over. There's a building. Oh, here. there is a building. Oh, okay. Yeah, I saw a building. Because I was like, bro, there, had, there was like a building. There's a building there. Oh, and there's a car. Any close. I was nowhere close. Okay. You were I mean, here. The building didn't look the same, though. It was I need to step up my you remote were, view. No, you were here, and we were here. <laughs> wow. That's it. You were flying. <laughs> oh, yeah, I started on top of the building, and then I came down. Some told me to turn around, though. No, nah, it was nowhere near but there are, There's people here, because there's a car, and the building, and Bruh. the cameraman, guys, never forget. Okay, that. this is... that's pretty Mavi, nice. can you, like, give me some tips on how to... How like, does that work? Because, yeah. uh, it wasn't I mean, super successful. You are trying to do too much with it. Like, the first one, you thought it was a base, like, why would I got, why would I send you guys to a, like, a reptilian base <laughs> for <laughs> the first time on your remote moving? <laughs> <laughs> and I don't have a photo of a base. <laughs> That's been like ancient civilization, bro. I mean, I don't. <laughs> you know, definitely I don't was thinking about that. To problem. do remote moving. I kept seeing I'm the tree mainly. I mean, the the one that we were currently on, and uh, it did feel a bit dark. <laughs> what I just sent you. I'm I'm gonna. Send it to you now, guys. Like what you I done revealed that. something about me. That's crazy. Oh fuck, you're doing nice. Costa Rica. You got the breeze. You got the calm. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I think I was getting, <laughs> I was losing focus. Kinda like nice. <laughs> Ali, you got some similar image too. Like you draw the path and the trees. Oh, Alaya is killing it. I thought I was tripping Baby at girl. first. <laughs> That's what I got. I sent it to you now, but this is like what I got like on the to you guys to see. Oh yeah, my one was quite the opposite. Energetically, like it was really dark. You, you yeah, got, oh I, my god, nice cut. That was videos. definitely off. <laughs> it's a dark, <laughs> cold human. <laughs> forest. I mean, like Amazing. I told you, uh, maybe was maybe like, it might he, have... he, he was here. Ah, so maybe there might be like a abandoned <laughs> church at, there. Or, at, at a reptilian base or something. Okay, well, it's okay. You guys maybe can it was skip some of if you need to feel like a break. Like it might have been a different time too. Like it might have been more at night because you. Okay, so I got two more. Uh, hold on. <laughs> I got two more. <laughs> we can do them like slowly. If you guys don't have much time, I can skip these two. And go to the last one. So, do you guys feel like doing? <laughs> today I got yeah. time, huh? Yeah, do do what you feel like you should do, Robbie. Okay. Yeah. okay. Okay. This time I give no spoilers. Oh. Just uh, number. Fuck. Okay. And for this one, I want you guys to try to be more simple and quick with it, if you can. Ooh. 
Okay. So, so like, we can do it remote viewing. I did okay, actually go to real places like the previous ones, but yeah, this is a real place on Earth different. that you can visit. Fuck no spoilers. What do I do? <laughs> what do I do? It is not Blood. a secret base. <laughs> There's a spoiler. It's not, it's it is not. not a, <laughs> it's not. Um, a. No, I usually it's just not the place. A place on Earth, but it's kind of a special place. Uh, okay. For some people, maybe. Man. Ink. Okay. If you guys feel like need a break, you don't. You can't sp skip this one. Yeah, I'm getting like one single detail. Hmm. I think I have mine. Okay. I got. Oh, you done? I mean, yeah. I have two stuff in my mind. Like, which is it? This or that? But apart from this, not anything. Yeah. I don't think. I don't even know why I saw in the first one you said about uh, an American base. Like, why would you send me to a pony and thing? <laughs> You must clear your mind, young Padawan. <laughs> Wait, what a, what's a Padawan? I don't know either, but it's some on Star Wars, so yeah. <laughs> I want to start. Uh, I guess I'll say Star young Wars. grasshopper. Um, I want to start watching Star Wars since you know, like my to like connect with my Orion life. Yeah, you might learn something. You're so sweet. Okay. Thank you so much. I mean, I was so nervous, but right now I am. I feel not good. Bro, this server alone is like oh, yeah. focused in general. So yeah, I do appreciate it as well. Thank you guys so much. You know, like, gee, you, know, you can't even hear anything. It just, like, closed. Oh. <laughs> that was the even it says. Oh, nah, thank y'all. Like, for you guys, like, you shouldn't be afraid to open your mic. You know? You shouldn't be afraid to open your mic. Okay, I'll let you remote view. I don't even think I'm. I mean, I that. do like presentations and stuff in Astro sometimes, but I'm not like a teacher, so this is my first class. No, uh, and I'm loving it. Ash, like I was speaking mm -hmm. to him. Mom, um, maybe you are traveling to, you know the. There's like an academy? I don't even know. It. Never. I, I don't remember like my dreams. Like they tell me to write my dreams, but it, how can I like write my dreams if I have nothing to write? Meditation. <laughs> yes. Like... Meditate, sleep early, and try to like sleep at least eight hours. Yeah. Yeah, don't don't be like me, because I'm over here surviving off of three, so yeah. I know. Yes, don't I, feel I like normal. Like, sleeping on your back <laughs> helps, but Yes. No, I, I never sleep so, like that. I don't even know but why I do. it helps sleeping on your back. I don't even Not know. Yet, that Rabbi uh, okay, Ella, yeah. sleep around 2 or 3 a.m. I know. What? Uh, yes, I sleep late, 
But It's I just... also wake up late. <laughs> Damn, unproductive. <laughs> no, but yes, I I like... yes, I said yes. You're amazing. So no, if but... you guys are um, ready to reveal the reveal yeah, for I'm the ready. reveal, okay. <laughs> you wanna see what? Yeah, it seems like an important building. That's all I got. Okay. I think it was not really. <gasps> okay. It does okay. a process of. Sh Like an ancient. I I was at it. I, I got the statue. Of I feel like I saw it in real like time, that. but my mind no. fused because it went between so... the White House and like an Eastern Palace. For me, I got two places. I had like the Statue of Liberty and like the Roman church. Yeah, something That's like that. I got. I oh got my God, Alaya, you're amazing! Oh my goodness, What? did I? Am... I serious? might be really good at this. Yeah, <laughs> bro. Like, you did it. Oh my yeah, god! I, think of... I just you're got palace vibes. I got palace vibes. Yeah. Oh my god, girl! <laughs> oh gee, that's crazy. And... Oh, she drew it. Girl, I mean, you I did. Could... I did think amazing. of like a holy place. Thank you. I did think of a holy place, like on the cathedral part side of it. I mean, there is like a, a mosque here. No, oh, so I mean, mm -hmm. right-ish. How is Alia so good at this? I'm jealous. So for the next one. Okay. This is the last no one that we're going either. to do. No spoilers on, either. On Earth? Right. Well, I give spoilers. Now we're gonna go to Alien Plan. Oh, this I is. Might skip this one. I have a bad headache. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh, you yeah, can skip this one. Intense. This okay, we can only. definitely okay. skip this one, or we can all skip together. But <laughs> don't skip this one. It's interesting because I get a surprise in the end after this one. So this one's a crazy. I just one. want you. So I just want two information about this place. You don't have to guess everything, okay? There is a main theme color, and there is an event, and I want you guys to just guess those things. <clears throat> So guess a color, and guess, try to guess like a event. So I'm going to give you a minute. Hmm. I kind of try to ask my guys for this one, so let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> it's like now when you like haven't revised or like studies for it, they're like, "Fuck it, guys, please help me." <laughs> it's like, nah. Who needs um? studying and revision when you got guides <laughs> right yeah. i mean but even they were giving me riddles so i mean <laughs> now nah, they speak in riddles they're like no nah, we're, we're gonna still give you a hard time in the thing mm -hmm. nah. at least for you guys that are out of school you don't have to have six hours uh... of sanity loss <laughs> well in a way i'm still in training And my whole body hurts, so yeah. They want training. Oh my god, so I, I specifically asked for certain things to manifest, and they're putting me through the ringer right now, so yeah. <laughs> uh, When you ask for the big things, they, yeah, you, you get tested. Uh, my guides, yeah. It's like now, nah, like when um, in religions, they like, they like pray to like, uh, like instead of like, nah. For me, like, nah, who cares about revising and studying when you can, like, you know, if you're religious, you could pray or spiritual, like, us, you could ask your guides. <laughs> But, like, if you're just an atheist, you just say, ah, fuck it. <laughs> okay, if you guys ready, I'm going to continue. I have prepared for this moment. So, I just asked two questions. Drum roll. 
a color you're like the main white. color you're getting from this place white and, and okay i feel like not correct <laughs> okay so if you guys are ready i'm going to open the image Hmm. I am open it. <laughs> yes, yes. You guys are ready. Oh, yes, yes. yes. Okay. It was Bruh. a pretty oh, day wow. parade in oh, Ireland. That was so the, oh, green. The only, the only thing yes, I got green. Yes, right. green. It was green. You, you want to know what's funny? The I only... literally used the numbers. And I was like, okay, it must be a chakra that's in the middle because the only two numbers that are alternating yeah, I are it was the ones like, that are in the middle. Like, but I ignored that completely. The event I thought it was like right before <laughs> the first moon landing when like all the people were watching like the rocket <laughs> and shit like in six. Like, there are red in the background. I yeah, thought it was orange. Christmas at first because I kept There's seeing orange. green, but There's I was like, it, that doesn't like... feel right. <laughs> I'm not all even. Nice, it was nice. You're doing amazing. Irish people would understand better than me. Okay, huh. so I'm well. we're almost done, guys. Oh my god, I'm so thankful you guys, you know, stayed. Oh my god, Sarah, you're back just in time, girl. So we're done, almost. I just got one last one. This is ama mm. amazing. Please. 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 I mean, I did Eric see the red and the, the, last the blue, one. I guess. Just help me on this one. Okay, it's okay, guys. I mean, red. some of. Some of you guys got the green. That's nice. I mean, I got the orange, but... You got a red dwarf. I mean, uh, there are red-headed, like, elves <laughs> in <laughs> Ireland, like, like oh, a symbol. Yeah. So basically, you just saw this guy! Because <laughs> okay. the first yeah, color was red, cool. but I didn't want to say Fuck, that. you got this guy! <laughs> That's crazy. This, this motherfucker. Sure All this that. time! You just pose on <laughs> It's okay. I mean, it's showing me more about myself, though. Yeah. I had fun in this. Okay, I mean, I now the last one. You guys oh. ready? I want silence. I guess this I on the last picture. I said astro yeah, okay. in the last... What the hell? Yes. This is somewhere in the astral. So I want you guys to actually use your astral body for this one. So if you want... If you were, like, just using your third eye, just... Use your astral body because this is an astral place. Okay? And uh, the spoiler this is a place some, not all, some GFL agents sometimes visit, some don't. Ah, uh, so that's gonna be interesting. So, Wait, no more spoilers. Visit this place? So, this <laughs> is an astral place, and I want you to try to guess. Like, basically, I want you to use your astral body to visit this place using this code like you're there and i just want you to write the vibes and stuff you see okay so okay so because this is robbie is it the place where I mean, we had the meeting sarah india no don't say anything right now i want silence i don't even know how how to do this thing that's why i'm asking you <laughs> <laughs> you know the astral is something else. No, no this is. Like... I mean, because that's that's the um, only place I can see actually. That's why I'm asking. No, no. I mean, I like uh, because this is a place in the astral. So obviously, um, I don't Luca, have an no image. Point. I don't have a photo of the place, like the real photo. I just have like a symbolic photo. I'm going to show you guys. So I just want. Yes, it is. I mean, you might get inside or you can i just want you guys to kind of observe the place kind of like an outside uh, point of view uh, yeah i just I think if you want you can my go PC inside. wallpaper i got my Imagine... PC wallpaper which okay. seems like a For this... planet uh. okay so <laughs> <laughs> don't mind i want to little silence <laughs> for a little time because i really want you guys to do like astral Projection to this place. Okay. Interesting. I got something. Very good.
Spooky shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no. Thing with remote viewing is. Okay, nice. I have Noah. my final You're answer. Fast. I just have a picture. It's just my PC world data. Oh, you're done too. Cute. Oh, you guys are starting to do it very fast. I am very proud. Done. Oh, Ole, done too. Okay. I'm done. Oh my god. Okay, so this is basically like an astral place. Is that the so... place? Is that the place? I sent like not on the DM on the thing, the chat. Uh, no, this is not. Yeah. I mean. There is not act. There's not an, not like a actual image of the place because this is a place in the astral. But I'm just going to show you guys. Yeah, like a, like you don't need a legit image. Photo and tell you the name of the place. You know, so you will get it. Uh, I want to visit. Everybody's ready. Is everybody ready? ready. Is yes. everybody ready? Okay. Now. <laughs> <laughs> Drum rolls. Three. Two, one, one. <laughs> oh, What's going on here? You just got SG! Oh, 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 Maybe that's why I didn't. You're in the SG! That is so funny. I literally drew a big circle. <laughs> Maybe just kind of seeing colors. Maybe. I was like, okay, okay. Seeing that was Hold on, wait. Hold on, guys. <laughs> That's so what are you doing in my jail? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh hell no. Oh my god. That's so Andy, funny. <laughs> oh my god, Andy literally dropped. <laughs> Alright. Sorry guys. Well oh, no. I swear, there's another thing. <laughs> Some ass whooping right. Please. Okay, so... What is it, actually? <laughs> no! <laughs> I mean... You just got ass of jail, but... I am the queen of ass of jail, so it's okay. Yeah. <laughs> You're not maybe jailed, guys. The, maybe Welcome to the ass of jail, though. Maybe I'm so happy you are. <laughs> maybe being in the wrong place. Is it actually a good thing, maybe, after project? No, no, you guys are my visitors. You guys, you know, my. I will uh, give you all a tour. <laughs> mm, okay. Sorry. Okay. I ain't sorry. That was a trap. I mean, by the way, if there was like a little secret archons who were watching my class, and if they did. As we travel, just now, I got them. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. I was getting a feeling about something. I'm not even going to But I thought it was I mean, just I literally like, told you guys to not go inside. <laughs> you trapped. I, don't know. I was getting, I was like, what, was what if this is a trap? What if, what if she, like, you watching on this trap? You know what I'm saying? Like, all of my alerts started going off, so I just went for the clouds. That's what you know I'm saying. No day, you trap. That's so no, you funny. You cannot. Run away from the Asu Jail. Asu Jail will find everyone. <laughs> I mean, you guys are all good. I mean, Asu Jail is for the, you know, Archons. Well, Mark for, like um, a big. But you can, I can give you guys a tour. Well, Mark's like a big. Yes. Yeah, but I want to see what your Asu Jail looks like. Curious. I mean, you can. There are two ways to, you know, learn. <laughs> you can mm -hmm. uh, learn as a visitor or a prisoner. <laughs> it's I, mean, I mean, game is game, but like, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah game, game's good. Nah, even better. You just like destroy it and easy. <laughs> no, <laughs> um, in no trying to ask for. You don't have to do anything bad. If you want, I can prison you right now. <laughs> nah. Oh hell no. I just get it. I'm <laughs> the monkey. She's not. <laughs> so, this was the end, guys. Any questions before we end the class? How do I improve on it? 
like <laughs> astral projection and just lucid dreaming and remote viewing. I uh, love you. Thank you, Rina. How do I like improve on it? Since my remote viewing experience so far was a bit strange. <laughs> With all the Bye. government things. For hanging out, it was a really long class, sorry guys. Mm. It literally took more than two hours. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah, this was day. really That's fun. Me. I loved it. Thank you so much, Robert. Yeah, this was really you. fun. Do uh, you have any tips for me? Uh, thank you, guys. Bye. Thank you, Robbie. It's Babel Slay. Thank you, Robbie. Goodbye. You're welcome. It was so fun. Yes. Any so if you, if anyone has a question before I leave, any you can, tips? You are free to ask. Any tips for me? Any tips? Just yeah. practice. Like the <laughs> stuff I told you at the beginning. You can, you know, oh. practice doing step by step. I have That's a question. About, like, yep. viewing my room. So, how did you get the codes for the places? I give just random codes. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I, just made I bind the codes to the images, so it will just... Uh, binding the codes to the images. Okay. You should no. give us one now, and then tomorrow give us the answer. Okay, I can um, open a. In the server. Okay. I mean, where was the... Yes, here. These are the practices. Robbie, I'm gonna go, okay? Okay, love you, babe. Thank you okay, for love you too, babe. joining. Love yeah, you, bye. 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 Love you, Love you, love you. Alright. Bye, and. Okay, if there are no more questions, I'm ending the event. Peace out, thank you. You're welcome, Great guys. Class. Thank you for joining. Bye. Class, Bye, everyone. Thank you, Skin. This was fun. Thank Super you. fun. Uh, thank you, guys. <laughs> I'm so red, by the way. My cheeks are like burning. You did amazing! I loved it so much. <laughs> and I didn't now. use any Turkish words! I spoke just English, guys. Are you guys were great. I knew it was gonna...